Hey guys, how's it going? So in this video, we're going to be talking about AMD. AMD stock heading to $100 soon. Well, I think it's a possibility. It's got multiple upgrades. Uh, and on top of that, they are set their new CPU that they launched not too long ago, the Ryzen 55,000 series. Uh, these are their high margin products. They sold out. They sold out with, they sold out within minutes. Soon as they launched, they completely sold out, and that's only positive for the company because when you sell out of something, you are making money. So, I think AMD Ryzen. I think AMD is gonna report excellent earnings when they do report earnings, which is sometime in January, maybe. I I have no uh. So yeah. So next year. So in the new year, they'll be announcing earnings and supposedly the earnings will be good. But, you know, they, AMD has so many products launching and I just feel like AMD has a lot of momentum on its side. But again, you know, AMD's also considered a little overvalued, but sometimes stocks can be extremely overvalued and, you know, it can just keep going up. At the end of the day, I keep, I hate saying this, but ultimately the stock market is a playing ground for rich people and they really dictate the stock price at the end of the day. So if big money wants to push this stock price up higher, they will. I think uh, the buying opportunity days were over. It was when it was right down here, you would have... You could have made it off like a bandit, but I still think AMD stock is heading higher. Uh, right now, you know, it's either if you're bullish on the stock, I would say the best play would be call options, but that's just my opinion. Uh, so if we look at the charting of AMD right now, it looks bullish. It looks like the bottom's in and the stock is going to continue to run. But again, we'll see. I mean, Donald Trump could. St potentially start another market crash and we can see it go back to $75 so it's up to you at the end of the day what you want to do but uh, I'm bullish right now and I think AMD is going to head higher could be wrong it's got multiple upgrades so yeah and uh, if AMD heads higher Xilinx will head higher because AMD has promised to buy out Xilinx AMD and Xilinx together will make a lot of money a lot of money so very bullish on the AMD and Xilinx combination uh, NVIDIA NVIDIA is uh, up $16 and 8 cents uh, today like NVIDIA is valued at 359 billion I feel like AMD will be making more money than NVIDIA in the near future here but that's just my opinion uh, AMD, uh, NVIDIA is making about you know, three billion dollars per per year. I think AMD is going to do four billion dollars next year I, with with the combination of Xilinx and the fact that you know they are going to be making uh they're probably going to steal a lot of server market share from Intel. They're probably going to steal a lot of computer market share from uh you know Intel, and they are probably going to take. Uh, a significant amount of sh market share away from NVIDIA in the GPU market. I think AMD is a huge growth story and I think AMD is going to do very well in the future but short term I think it's going to go higher because that's what the charts are telling me. Long term, uh, uh, long term I think it's going to head higher too. So I think, I think eventually AMD will head to $100. My opinion, we'll see what happens. Uh, and the PlayStation 5, which I'm very excited for, is launching very soon here. And another company I'm very bullish on for the short and long term is GameStop. I think GameStop could be a really big winner long term, but that's just my opinion. Intel is uh, up four cents after hours. Uh, Aurora is falling down 35 cents. It's not that bad considering the fact that, you know... It's been pumped so much lately, but we'll see on Monday where the stock price goes. Canopy growth is down 18 cents after hours. I think when they report earnings on Monday morning, 
we'll see what happens but i think that the stock will plummet uh village farms will probably get dragged down with canopy hexo is prob hexo is down a penny after hours i still think that there's a possibility hexo could break a dollar we'll see if that happens but you know it might get dragged down with canopy on monday uh afria is uh up seven cents after hours the very good food company is just trading sideways uh biden and trump it seems like the the electoral votes have been at a standstill it, like i don't know i don't know what to say i think uh, donald trump's gonna lose and i think uh, biden's going to drag donald trump out of the white house that's why i think it's gonna happen but i think there's gonna be a long slow painful pro process uh the market right now is you know just Trading sideways, kind of flat. Oil took a big hit today. Nordic American tankers. Uh, this could be an opportunity down here, especially if oil keeps going down. Not financial advice, just my opinion. Cineplex Odeon today was down 19 cents. Nano Dimension is up 3 cents after hours. Solo is up 5 cents after hours. The Rocket Company is up 7 cents after hours. Men Men will Men Men is up another half a penny. Uh, Snap is uh, getting pushed up by rich people. Sixty seven billion dollars for a company that makes six hundred million dollars of revenue and loses two hundred million dollars of profit. You know, seems a little overvalued, but you know that's the markets for you. T Guard had a nice day today, but we'll see where this goes. Uh. Diamond Ride, Volatile Day, yeah, I don't know, I don't know, this is basically the market, Zoom, Down a Penny, Ianthus, see, this is, the, I was like looking at this stock, I wish I bought some, because I was like looking at it, like around 8, 9 cents, I was like thinking of buying some, I would have made it off like a bandit if I did it. Almost 100% return on investment if I sold it at 20 cents. Um, I think Ianthus has some kind of value to somebody. That's why the stock is getting pumped. That's what I think. Uh, last mile holdings down half a penny. Liberal Health Science. Uh, today up 4.5 cents. 9.52 cents. High tide today, just trading sideways. Um, Kira up ninety three cents. True is up one dollar and fifteen cents. Hearth. is trading sideways anyways that is it for my video thanks for watching subscribe for future updates and have a great day bye